for Rudge. Line drive right field. That's going to get down for a base hit. One run will score. Here comes the second run. Out at the plate. No safe. Now they got Guzman caught in a rundown. Guzman's going to go to second base. He's not safely. A third run scores. Brownsville clears the bases, and the tying run is in scoring position. Well, there are times when things just get loose, and that's exactly what happened right there. It was a base hit. The infield was drawn up. I wasn't sure why that was happening. The throw to the plate was in time. Here comes the tag at the plate. Does he get his right foot under? It does. The tag was high. Kind of settled your team down a little bit. May make a move. Strike three. Big strikeout by Dominguez. But that's only the first pitch right there. He's been away, away, away. And then this pitch comes inside. And gets, it, gets it by Maldonado. who had a couple of good swings in the at-bat. You can see Guzman will stop at third. And the winning run is now on first base. And Keith with first and third, one out. Do you think about some kind of a steal? Kevin Flores is the hitter. Shortstop throw back to first. Double play to end the game. Wow. You know, it, it was going to end in dramatic fashion for somebody one way or the other. Line drive to the shortstop, make the play across the foot to dive back to first. I'm not sure he got to the back. Every play is reviewed. This is, this is being reviewed right now. The final play of every game is reviewed. I don't think he ever got the back. He got caught in between Mabry's legs. And Mabry was just striding. It was not intentional. He did not try to draw, block the play, but it being reviewed. He was just striding out to catch the ball, the same as any first baseman. His hand never got to the bag. Garcia slid back. He just slid right into Mabry. I think that was a desperation attempt slide to get back. To get back. Put this result into context, Keith. Well, you know, I've covered this event for a lot of years, yeah, and, and it's been played here in Waco since 2002, and we have not seen a Texas team from Texas West go 0-2 in this tournament. That's how large this is. What a game, one of the best games we've had here over the course of the years. It came down to the final play of the game. We saw two of the wildest plays in the bottom of the sixth inning. Texas West entered the frame down by four with the bases loaded.